Hello, everybody. My name is Johnny Alexander Salazar. I am PhD student of the University of Granada in Spain. This presentation is titled Pervasiveness for Learning in Serious Game Applied to Older Adults. The origin of the research is from the proposal of a doctoral thesis titled Evaluation Process of Play and Fun Experience in Older Adults Using Pervasivity to Promote Active Aging. This research it's done by the University of Granada in Spain. Contrary to what we think, other adults represent 21% of the total number of players and are the second largest population group, according to data published by the Entertainment Software Association. Many cases of application of digital games in other adults are interested in promoting active aging, understanding of the process of optimizing opportunities for health participation and security in order to improve quality of life as people age. Some current applications used to promote active aging include sensor, remote hardware, computers and digital technology, cameras and mobile device, virtual, augmented and mixed reality. All these technologies are a new paradigm such as pervasive games. But what is a pervasive game? A non-pervasive game is a role player in a certain place during a certain time and with certain people, while a pervasive game is not limited for these characteristics. Proposed model. Six transversal elements adjusting to the particularities of older adults that should be considered. When designing pervasive experience for the senior, this being aesthetics, narrative, technology to be used, game roles, purpose, and ethics. Aesthetics. Aesthetics in the game refer to all and visual and some elements that are presented in the game experience as well as the interaction. To achieve this, familiar environment should be generated, which can be achieved with the application of real world things, making use images, sounds, videos, and user properties, and the base configuration. The purpose. The purpose is the reason why the other other decide to play, investing his time to interact with the game experience offer. In the particular case of serious game focused on learning for other adults, it's necessary to consider that a motivating strategy is to offer useful common knowledge applicable to their daily life. Rules. All elements of the game should be oriented to offer the player rich for the appropriate person understand of the zone in which there is balance between the challenges of the game and the skills of the player. This characteristic is simple rules, game and familiar environment, is look piece that can be played for a short period of time, that involves some kind of cognitive challenge, and that is not very demanding. Technology. Interaction technologies provided to other adults should be those that offer a few buttons in order to prevent psychological burden. In addition, this population prefers direct and natural input device, such as a touch screen that allows simple action in a transparent way and without much effort. Narrative. When narrative and purpose are integrated, a narrative evolution or extinct narrative must be generated. This defines the objects, characters, and all components of the story will be being transmitted in the game experience throughout the narrative in the real or virtual world. Ethics. Games in many occasions seem to make common sense or disappearing people, such as playing while driving, playing while walking and crossing the street or accessing enough to rise, because the game now that consider the element, the fulfillment and objectives. Conclusion and future work. Pervasivity becomes an interesting approach to the advantages offered to other adults. The research offers advances in the design of progressive service games, focus and learning in other adults, offering a total of six transversal elements that should be considered. As future work, future extension of the research will be included that's applied to a user with the super and, and functional prototype as a progressive service game focused on learning process. Thanks for your attention. See you later.